CTV News, Vancouver Island Report. Good evening. A stretch of the Inland Island Highway north of Courtney was closed for several hours today following a grim discovery, a body found at about 9 o'clock this morning along the side of the road. The person who found it called 911 and within moments police had converged on the scene. And as CTV's Gord Kerbis shows us now, the Island District Major Crime Unit has taken over the investigation. Flaggers redirect southbound traffic along the Inland Island Highway. They've been here for more than six hours, keeping traffic away from a major crime scene that exists a few kilometers away. We're working with the BC Coroner Service, uh, as well as a team of officers from the Vancouver Island Integrated Major Crime Unit, as well as Comox Valley Detachment, Campbell River Detachment, and the Forensic Identification Section. Police were drawn to the site after receiving a 911 call from someone who thought they'd made a disturbing discovery. Shortly before 9 a.m. this morning, uh, we received a call uh, uh, from a traveler on Highway 19 uh, between Comox and Camel River. Uh, the driver reported that they saw what they believed to be a, a body on the side of the highway. When they arrived, police did indeed find the body of a dead adult lying just off the highway. The area was immediately sealed off. Uh, at this point, we're conducting an investigation into the, uh, the death, uh, trying to answer the many questions that come with uh, discovery like this. More than a dozen police vehicles, including a command center, were set up at the scene. All southbound traffic was closed off to keep the officers safe. Traffic passing northbound could only get brief glimpses of the investigation underway. Uh, the coroner service is obviously conducting their investigation at the scene. They are primarily responsible for uh, examining uh, a body that's found, uh, found deceased. So once they've got some information to pass over to us, we'll, we'll be able to uh, share that publicly. At this point, police won't say whether the adult was a man or a woman, but they do say they're conscious of a recent missing person case involving 33-year-old Elizabeth Marie Lagus. The Kingham Inlet woman was last seen two days ago in Campbell River. Anytime that we discover uh, a body in a public area like this and it's not immediately identified and we don't know a cause of death, uh, one of the first things that we do is look at outstanding missing person cases and uh, that's what we're doing right now. But police are reluctant to make that link with Lagus or any missing person. Uh, out of respect for the families of the missing people uh, that we have right now identified as missing, we're not going to be making any speculation as to who it may or may not be. Um, but certainly we are conscious of those cases and we're, we're examining them all. The scene is just north of a major brake check area for truckers. Police are asking anyone who may have seen anything suspicious in the area over the past few days to give them a call. Gord Kerbis, CTV News.